How's it going, everyone? And welcome back to Let's Play Fantasy Star. Uh, so I've been a little busy off the screen again. Let's go ahead and pull up our game. So last time we went out to uh, another planet. We recruited Mayu, and then we explored this dungeon. We recruited Odin, and we received the compass. Since we were last here, I have done a little bit of leveling up again. Alice is now level 10. No gear has changed. Mayu is up to level 6. And Odin is up to level 7. So first thing we're going to do is we're going to head south of here to another town that we have not been to yet. Blow through a couple of swarms. Now around this town I gotta be careful because there's some monsters here that are still nasty even for me. Like these guys. Uh, three of them too. I don't know if fighting these is a good idea or not. I think we better run. Oh, frick. No, they not. Let's go ahead and tough it out here. I think we can take this. I don't know, they've got a lot of HP. And I've still got some magic points, so... That wasn't good. Give Mayu another heal. That was close. So yeah, I was right. We are definitely not ready for that. Um, okay, so we're in a new town. This is the town of Epi. Let's start by the entrance. That's obviously a place to heal, and we will visit there. First, let's go over here to the armory. Now, Odin's already got an iron axe, but the needle gun is a very good weapon for him. So we'll buy that, and we'll buy him a bronze shield. Go ahead and equip those. Got some better gear equipped. And let's talk to everybody here. The governor of Motiva might possibly help you well. Okay. Noah lives on Motiva. Are you looking for a dungeon key? Why not? I've hidden a dungeon key in the warehouse on the outskirts of Kamenit. That could be useful. Dr. Luveno had a laboratory in the Gothic Forest long ago, it is said. Well, we don't know who Dr. Luveno is yet. Do you know what the hardest, strongest material in our world is? No. It's Laconia. Arms made with Laconia are the best to have. Well, we are... Eh, we're not too terrible. Let's go ahead and chance it. We're going to try to return to Kamenit. Okay, I should be safe from the werebats at this point. Let's 
So that's the big difference with Odin's new weapon, is Odin's new weapon hits every enemy in a group. So that is very nice to have, especially when you get groups of five, six monsters. Go ahead and rest. And let's go get that dungeon key. You might remember this dungeon. We got 50 mesetas from here earlier. And now there's a treasure chest here. This was not here when we first came in. And there's our dungeon key. So with the dungeon key in our possession, we'll go ahead and leave here. Now then, we've got some money. And I'm trying to make a decision. I can either... We've got 1,600 mesetas, which is enough to get the next sword from Al for Alice, and having her damage go up would definitely be nice. On the other hand, it's also enough to get a very nice item from the secondhand shop, I think, in Scion, which is the... No, in uh, the other half here, which is the magic lamp, and I think that's what I'm going to go for. The uh, magic lamp basically makes it so you never need to buy a flash again. So you never have to worry about being in a dungeon and not having something to light up the darkness. So let's go ahead and buy the magic lamp. Now we will never have to buy another flash for the whole game. Okay, so we've got the dungeon key. We're all a, little, all a little stronger. We're healed. Let's go ahead. First, let's go ahead and save our game. Just in case, because you never know what's going to happen. And I want to check something in here really quick. We're going to swing by the church. Nobody needs to be resurrected, but I can come here, and it will tell you how much experience is needed to level up. Alice needs 96, Mayu 113, Odin 124. So let's go ahead and we are going to head for the next dungeon. We got a pack of swarms here. Swarm is killed. We got a single wing eye. Wing eye is killed. The next dungeon is just past Scion here. Got a dead tree. These are actually really good to uh, level up against, as they give you a lot of mesetas for this stage in the game. So now that we have the dungeon key, we can use it and we can enter here. Now this is the first kind of especially large dungeon. Empty chest. Oop, we got four gold lenses. Three gold lenses. You see right away why Odin's weapon gets quite nice. Q. 
came out of that quite nice, so we should do fine against most of the monsters of this area. Three werebats. We've got Odin's gun now, which will help wear them down faster. Let's go around and see what happens. We're in pretty good shape, let's take him. That's what you have to worry about here. Got one almost down, though. Ooh, that hurt. Oh, crap. One left. We got him. But that was close. If we get more than one or two of those at a time from now on, we're gonna run. And of course, there was a trap. Let's get my healed. Just one, I'll fight it. Yeah, 
Yeah. Um, I think before we're really gonna be ready for this, let's get out of here. We're going to need to get a little stronger. Uh, maybe not so much level-wise. No oh, crap, four gold lenses. I think we can handle this, though. But from an equipment standpoint, and not only that, we're just not prepared as far as... I should have stocked up on burgers to heal, which I did not do. Um, and quite honestly, we just don't have enough time for this video to explore the enormity of this dun cave, because it's a uh, four-story dungeon. So I'm going to go ahead and head back to Camp Eat and rest. And once there, we will go ahead and wrap this up. And then I will do a little more money grinding off camera. And get some better gear. Maybe even, uh, how much do we have? Oh my god, one step. Tarantula. This might not be a good idea. That could be bad. Odin's free. We've almost got him. Mayu is tied up. Six HP left. We gotta get out of this area. We're wearing down pretty bad. Tell you what, how much money do we have? 867, I know what we'll do to wrap this up. If I can get out of here. Okay, two of these are not fighting blocks. There we go, we got away. This should go real really fast. Gotta get out of this little extension here. Okay, we're back to weaker enemies. So yeah, as you can see, this game definitely you need to do a lot of preparation. It is not a very forgiving game in terms of difficulty and how much it throws at you. for Mayu, and then we will wrap it up. So yeah, I know I can get a better sword, shield, and armor for uh, Alice for about 3,000 mesitas. So, I should be able to earn that fairly quickly in the, uh, cave and get my characters a little stronger at the same time. So, I will do that and between episodes, and next episode we will go straight into that cave and conquer it. So, we 
actually a swing by the weapon shop here. I believe it's the one on the end. Nope, the second hand. Must be the one on the end. Nope, that's the dude we gave the Laconia pot to, so it must be here. There we go. Want a thick fur. And we'll go ahead and equip that on Mayu. Okay, so we're going to go ahead and save and wrap the video up here for today. I want to thank you for watching, and like I said, I'm going to go ahead and do a little more leveling and get up the money to get all the next upgrades for Alice. And then once we've done that, we will go ahead and next video we will conquer that dungeon we were just in. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video. Please uh, like and subscribe to the channel and throw any feedback you might have into the comments. I would love to hear from you. Thanks for watching and we'll catch you again next time.